Nothing on my end either. I spoke with the super at Cotty's building, but it seems she hasn't gone home. Been a long time since she vanished, too. Sure hope she's okay. Phone's going straight to voicemail, and she's not answering any of my emails. We can't even track her by GPS if her phone isn't on. I sent the word out to everybody I know in town. Told them to call me right away if anybody sees her. I've been checking Pitter, but no one said anything about a foreign maid. Without Raiko around, Mogra feels so sad and lonely. Yeah, don't know when it happened, but she really came to be like the Freedom Fighter's mascot. It's my fault. I was there, but I wasn't able to save her. Don't blame yourself, Rin. If anyone should be blamed, it's me. I'm the one who got you all mixed up in this in the first place. Okay, seriously, just stop. You are like the two most guilt-ridden people I have ever seen. It's ridiculous. You've both helped a ton at cutting down on the number of Synthester victims, you know. Shouldn't that count for something? <laughs> Toko's right. There's no reason to beat yourselves up over this. That Soga dude said he wouldn't do anything improper with her, right? Ah, oh, Miss Kasugai. Any word on Kati's whereabouts? Nothing yet. Oh dear, I certainly hope she's all right. Well, I don't know about the rest of you lot, but I'm tired of sitting here and worrying about her. If we got no new info yet, then let's get out there and find some. Sounds like a plan to me. Let's split up so we cover more ground. She must still be in Akiba somewhere. Got it. You bet. Let's get moving. You ain't going, Shion? I'm certainly concerned for Kati's safety, but I actually came to speak with this gentleman. So, are you available to talk? How about... We have ourselves a chat while we aid the others in their search. We can take the park area just before the station. She's a good girl, beloved by all, that Cotty. I truly hope she's unharmed wherever she is. <sighs> Sorry to change the subject, but I wonder if I might ask you a few questions. Firstly, have you been experiencing any physical abnormalities of late? Perhaps feeling a bit sluggish, or having your legs give out from under you, or maybe some slight dizziness? That's good, then. If that should change, however, please be sure you let me know immediately, all right? As it happens, when analyzing that blood sample I took the other day... <sighs> you... Conti, you're all right! I've come... to get 
She's not herself. She's being controlled. Come to get you. What do you mean you've come to get him? Can't sustain. Body breaking down. Need to help him or else. What? His future. Soga will protect. I don't understand. Come. Come with me. I won't let you take him. You can't just come and drag him away like that. <sighs> if you won't listen, then I'll have to take him by force. I don't think we have any choice but to fight. If Rin is correct, she should be weak to sunlight like all the others now. So let's strip her down. I got this. Let's go. Hey, ready and waiting. <laughs> let's go. One, two. Right, hold on. No problem. Lend me a hand. Let's yeah. One, two, go. I got this. Did it. We've stopped her. <laughs> huh? Hang in there. What's going on? You're burning up. It's just as I thought. You're not well. Please, stay with me. As I said, need to help him or else. All right. I believe you. You can take him to Soga if you must. But I have one condition. I'm coming along. He is not to go alone. Oh, very well. I'll show you the way. Follow me. Can you stand? Here, prop yourself up on my shoulder. You have a very high fever, and it's not something I suspect any hospital would be able to cure. We're headed to see Soga. I know it's not ideal, but nothing good can come of you dying on us. In fact, 
If you die, then everything we've done will be meaningless. So think lively thoughts. I'll make sure you get through this okay, no matter what it takes. Interesting. So the organization is using the construction site for the new Radio Kaikon building as its headquarters. Miss President! I mean, Miss Former President. Well, well, if it isn't Sakaguchi. So you do have ties to the organization, just as I suspected. Impressive work keeping me from proving it all this time. N never mind me. Why are you here? Why, indeed. She's here because I summoned her. Soga, sir! Actually, it's only the boy I summoned. The other one's an unexpected bonus. Oh? Is there some reason I shouldn't be here? No, no, you're quite welcome, I assure you. By all accounts, you're a rare prodigy in the fields of medicine and biology. Elected CEO at such a young age, you are, or were, like a modern-day noblewoman. And since you've come, I can only assume you intend to help us realize our goal. Or perhaps... Let's just say I'm listening. Though, if you want my help, I must forewarn you. It'll come at a price. Oh? And what might that be? First, you release Kati Raikkonen. And second... I see we're on the same page. Those are my two conditions. Do we have a deal? Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. This... is all I can do right now. You won't last much longer as you are. Soga, sir! You promised that if I drove this woman out of the company, you'd... The lady and I are speaking, Sakaguchi. And I prefer not to be interrupted again. Besides, it wasn't you who drove her out. As I recall, she left of her own volition. No? So? Everything is as it should be, and if you misunderstood our terms, that is strictly your fault. Ah! Uh, my, my deepest apologies, sir! Now, back to the matter at hand. In regards to your first condition, Kati will be released shortly, though not before I erase a few of her memories. You understand. As long as she's safe. As for the boy, the affliction he suffers runs deep. I cannot say for certain that I'll be able to cure him right away. What? But that means... Please, hear me out. I intend to do all that I can. First things first, I'd suggest he be adorned with this rosary. That should help keep his Night Eater side under control. His case is a complex one, having been transformed from a Synthester to a Night Eater's familiar. I fear the two powers are fighting one another within him, placing the very structure of his body in danger of breaking down. With that rosary suppressing his Night Eater blood, however, he should feel slightly better soon. You do seem more stable, at least for the moment. So, have I cleared your conditions then? 
For now, I'm afraid I have work to do. But when I need you, I will call. Understood. I suppose we can't very well go back to the Akiba Freedom Fighters now, can we? As I said before, please don't worry about me. Things do look bleak, but we've learned one very important fact. Your physical ailments come from the conflict between your Synthister blood and the Night Eater blood. If we could isolate one or the other and remove it from your body, or perhaps... I can't promise immediate results from this, but... I believe there may be something I can do for you. For now, though, you absolutely need caloric intake to help your body recover. In my professional opinion, we should go for some curry. Damn.